I was very fortunate many, many years ago, 25 years ago, to meet the great Henri Jaillet. Henri Jaillet could be called the godfather of modern red winemaking today. And he was a very humble uh, farmer who lived in Vaumeromenay in the Côte de Nuit in Burgundy and made um, arguably the most collectible red burgundies of all time. Um, I met him when he was a pretty old chap. He was on the eve of his 70th birthday. He'd come over to London, didn't speak very much um, English, and I had to sort of speak regional Burgundian, which is pretty, pretty tricky, but I'll never forget the evening. And uh, in meeting Jaillet, he enthused about his godson's estate, Mayu Camusé, and Mayo Camusé wines, now that Henri has passed away and gone to the great vineyard in the sky, Mayo Camusé wines are a place where you can still taste some of his influence. Um, also based in Vain Romanet, Jean-Nicolas Mayo Camusé now runs the estate. And uh, Jean-Nicolas is a young, sort of thrusting, kind of professional, um, you know, modern chap who is very aware of how historic the soils are in his vineyards but he's also very savvy and he understands the modern world. And this combination of skills is incredibly important these days. Um, he has under his belt some Grand Cru's. He has Richebourg, which is uh, just off the scale in terms of quality. But my favourite wine that he makes, it's not a Grand Cru, it's a Vain Romanet called Cru Parentou. From a tiny vineyard just behind the Grand Cru's, a little undulating vineyard, a tiny little plot of land, and in the right vintage, this can make a wine that soars above the Grand Cru's. He also makes you know, inexpensive wine as well, Bourgogne Rouge and a few village wines um, and a host of uh, very, very smart Premier Cru's from both his village, Vain Romanet, and the village next door, Nuit Saint-Georges. Um, Mayo Camusé wines are pretty difficult to find, sadly. Um, the production's very small. He just has one quite uh, compact cellar underneath his property. It's very, very cold down there. And this is another reason why the wines are so sought after. They're made very slowly and very elegantly and they're crammed, packed full of energy and they age forever. So um, difficult to find, um, there's no doubt about that. But look out for the Mayu Camusé name on labels. And my advice is probably to pop down to Burgundy because there are plenty of his wines in the restaurants down there. And that'd be a perfect way for you to introduce yourself to the wines. Mm -hmm.